So I just finished reading The Bling Ring by Nancy Jo Sales, and this is the true story of how a gang of fame-obsessed teens ripped off Hollywood and shocked the world. These events just happened a couple of years ago. These Calabasas, California teens stole from celebrities like Miranda Kerr and Ashley Tisdale, Lindsay Lohan, and even Paris Hilton. And it was so easy for these kids to steal from them because these celebrities just left keys under their mat. They left their doors unlocked. And it was just kind of crazy, but what was really even more crazy was the motivations that these teens had to steal. Nancy Jo Sales just does a really good job of kind of showing all their motivations and giving a lot of research onto why these teens felt the need to steal. And it was just really, really fascinating. I mean, a lot of facts and figures in here just kind of really open your mind up to why are we so obsessed with celebrities in America. While reading this book, you actually kind of do feel bad for the celebrities. I mean, yeah, so they do have a million Hermes bags and they stole one of them. But it's also their sense of privacy is invaded and that's just something that's really, you know, important to a celebrity. Their home is their sanctuary and these kids just kind of partied in it. It was really kind of crazy because some of these kids would go to Paris Hilton's house like six times and she didn't even notice. And they would use her party room and they would drink her champagne and you know just steal her cigarettes even so it was just kind of didn't really make sense but these kids stole these clothes and they got into the hottest clubs with these clothes on and they wanted to live the celebrity lifestyle and i think that's something that everyone wants a piece of and that's really what this book is about and why it's not really the greatest thing to have the celebrity lifestyle Another revelation I took from this book is that we kind of glamorize crime. I mean, these teens themselves became celebrities just from stealing from celebrities. So I definitely recommend reading this book before you see the movie with Emma Watson in it. Because the movie doesn't have a lot of dialogue, and this really kind of details everything that those teens were thinking. And it really just gets everything from all angles, the police, from the lawyers, and it's actually just really entertaining and really, really quick read actually. So even if you're not into facts and you know true stories, this is one that you can really dive into easily and get a lot out of it. Thanks for watching and get reading, but don't steal this from your local bookstore.